Oh, sorry, my mom called. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and um, my hair looks a mess because it's raining. I'm gonna go ahead and just like talk to y'all for a little bit. So, what's been going on with me? I have been working. I have been, you know, focused in school. I got two A's and two B's at my midterm, and then I just basically met up with my um advisor and we've been talking about like my next steps for next semester and stuff so what i've decided to do was a uh, minor in entrepreneurship because as you all or some of you all may know and if you're new hello hey girl how you doing hey too how you doing hey y'all um some of you all may know that i have a videography business that i am um, you know, trying to learn every day on how to be the best videographer I can be. You know, it can be very expensive, so I am going at my own pace, but I'm trying to build my portfolio right now. Like, um, on Saturday, I have an event. Um, it's the LGBT annual ball that I will be covering, so I'm excited about that. Um, but I have a videography business, I was saying, and minor in entrepreneurship will help me more on the business side. I know that um, I can research a lot of things, like I can buy a whole bunch of business books and things like that, but I'm a visual learner, so um, I need to know everything on the up and up and on the downsides of business, and also because I am a psych major, I do want to have my own practice, so in order for me to have my own practice, I'm going to have to take some type of business classes and things like that so i'm like why not minor in entrepreneurship because i will have my own private practice so that's why i am doing that um i think the vlog before that before the last one or the last no i think it was the vlog before that i um was inducted into psychi which is the international honor society of psychology and uh i'm excited about doing that uh, it's basically the psychology club that I have been talking about um, wanted to join for the past two years so I'm excited that I was inducted um, into that and so right now I'm looking into another organization surrounding psychology so if I move forward with that process I'll let you guys know um, how that goes um, and so, exciting news, we have booked a venue for the wedding. I'm so excited. So right now, it's just grind time because we got to pay for this venue. It's expensive, but it's just a dream. It's everything in it that we want. We're going to be able to customize every single thing. And I'm super, super excited because that just makes it more real. Like, it's about to be November. Let's see, no November, December, January, March. 17 more months before we say I do. So I'm excited. Oh my God. So yeah, um, Sunday, going to a bridal show with my mother-in-law, my aunt-in-law, and um, my mom. We're going to a bridal show. So I'll take you guys along with me for that. This week I've had like exams and stuff at school, so I haven't been vlogging at all. It's raining right now. And like I mentioned before, I just have some downtime to talk to you guys. Um, okay, what else has been going on? Um, I looked at my vision board, and, you know, I'm doing pretty okay, you know. Um, I am working on my credit still, because me and Cortland are wanting to buy a home soon. Um, I'm trying to figure out more, like, content and things for my channel. Like, I have things that I want to do, but, um my friends are not available for us to do some of the videos but there will be more videos coming with me and Cortland. um we still haven't sat down and recorded our engagement story and you know um, things like that you know i do want to do like some couples videos and things so <clears throat> excuse me so i do want to sit down with him and talk to him about that to see what we want to do uh what else we're supposed to be going to work back at home, but we have not yet, so still waiting on that. Uh, and once we're able to do that, then I'll be able to record more. Um, I did. I am teaming up with this um, company. I'm not going to give too much information, but I am teaming up with this company so I can... Um, I'm teaming up with this company to um, create videos for them. Stupid. Can't drive. I'm um, sorry. <laughs> I am, because I almost hit my rental. 
I mean, I'm a rental. I'll tell you about that in a second. I'm teaming up with this company to do um, produce content for them on their platform. So I just got to figure out what type of videos I want to do for that. Um, well, I do know what type. I just, again, got to figure out a time to record. Um, I think, so I am about to run a sale for my videography business. I'm thinking the first week or the first two weeks of November to give people like time and stuff. So I think I'm going to do that and I'll let you guys know more about that on November 1st or whenever that the first November vlog is. I'll let you guys know. Um, me and Siobhan and Kanisha are doing Friendsgiving. Um, I, prob I might invite a few more other people to do that too. It's just I don't have a lot of room at my house to do that. But, you know, we might make it work. So I'll just see who's all, you know, down to do that. Um, I'm doing a Friendsgiving with my mentor group. Possibly if it's on, if it's a day that I'm able to do it. It's on the 17th. I just have to see what day that'll be. And then um, we are in my mentor group. Also, we're doing a, um, we're serving at the Nashville Mission on the 25th of November. So I'm excited to do that. Then in December... Uh, I'm supposed to be going to New York. Oh, I'm not even going to say why. I'm just, I'm just supposed to... I'm, I'm, I'm going to edit that out. Um, okay, so December, I'm supposed to go out of town the second week in of December. And then the weekend after that, my sister Jay graduates from college. Hey! So, I got to bust and grind to get the money to do all of this because... Like, with the wedding, booking, and things like that coming up. Like, y'all, it's just it's gonna, it's taking my coins. But, you know, whatever. I'm going to try to make it work. Then, you know, we have the holidays coming up. I don't have anything planned except to work because I have to work on Thanksgiving. I got to work on Christmas. That's cool because that holiday pay is going to be good as long as people bring me a plate. I'm good. But um, that's cool with that. Okay, so about my car. I, for the last month, okay, since September... I think September like 12th or 13th or something like that. I took my car to go get service because my windshield wipers would not cut off. Like, y'all, they was on for like a month. So, yeah, they were on for like a month. And I went to go get that taken care of on top of like oil change and then some other minor stuff. I went to go put my car up. It took two weeks to do that, so they gave me a loan of car. So, I went to go put my car up. They didn't fix none of the other stuff I told them to fix. I was like, look... My freaking uh, engine light is on. I can't pass Marta with that being on. So, like, okay, we're going to fix that, blah, blah, blah. But then there was, like, the undershield under my car was dragging. So, they had to order a new car get that fixed. You know, taking my money, whatever. So, I'm like, okay, just do what y'all got to do for my car to work. So, then the second time I went to go get my baby, um, the freaking, um... The car wouldn't start. So, I'm pissed because I just paid them almost 300 freaking dollars. It was like three hundred dollars that I paid them, and my car wouldn't start. So they were like, "Keep the loaner car, blah blah." blah. So then they called me, and was like, "Um, what did he say to me?" He was like, "Well, I just got in the car and I just drove thirty four miles and it started it's working." Da da da, come get it. I'm like, "Listen, y'all need to check my car again because I don't care what you say, y'all did. It didn't start when I got to it. So they ended up replacing my battery for free. I went to go get it yesterday." yesterday i didn't even have the car for 12 hours and on top of some personal things that happened yesterday on top of that i went to go get some chicken right i went to go get some chicken to feed us in the parking lot of kroger the car did not freaking start so i'm beyond pissed i'm like i ain't even had this car 24 hours mind you i had to set up another appointment to take it back Tuesday, get another loaner car because um, the um, engine light was still on and the freaking airbag light is on. And I'm just like, listen, I cannot get tags with all this stuff on. I don't pay y'all. I didn't come into the dealership with these problems and I'm not about to leave with them either. So, um, yeah, I got it. I'll call the tow company, but I was still trying to turn the car on. So it did end up turning on. So she was like, just drive your car down there. And um, what she said? She was like, just drive your car there and then um, get a loaner car. So here I am in another loaner car. Um, I had a 2017 Dodge Dart is the loaner car I had. And it was really nice. And this is nice too. It's a Nissan uh, Sentra. 
I don't know what year it is, but ain't no telling how long I'm finna be in this freaking loaner car, but all I know is they better fix my sugar, okay? Sugar, that's my baby. They better fix her because I don't I don't got time. I'm not paying them a dime. So I will keep you guys updated on that. Um I just finished taking a test and now I'm waiting on Kanisha to come so we can have lunch. Oh, we ate at seafood. What is that on my chin? Oh, um, we ate a seafood sensation yesterday and I should have vlogged it. Y'all, it was so freaking good. Next time I go, I'll vlog. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have for the updates right now. Um, I will guess I'll just like say a quick hello when she gets in the car or whatever when I see her. And then that'll be all because this is going up tomorrow. It's Thursday, so this is going up tomorrow. Trying to stay committed to my Monday and Friday schedule. Um, yeah. So, how are you all liking that? Um, I need to promote myself more, of course. I'm about to do that right now since I stopped recording. But, um, yeah, I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. And then I may talk to y'all on my way to work or something like that. My eyebrows look good. I just got rid of the scraggly, so that was it. But my eyebrows look good. So, yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Hey, you guys. That was so fake. I'm pissed. <laughs> Girl. Okay, don't put that on there because I probably look scary as hell. You don't. You look harmless as AF. But, <laughs> I'm pissed, y'all. I ain't gonna talk about it. To, I ain't gonna talk about it. I ain't gonna do the black thing. Because I know y'all hoes still be shopping out there just like I do. Mind you, so she's talking about, about clothes. Everything business are all. We ain't gonna worry about it. I got a question for you, JDs. So if y'all order something online, sorry for the hand movement. And y'all do two day shipping. Don't y'all expect y'all stuff? Give it mm, 24 hours. Okay, that's one day, especially if you order in the morning. Okay, I should be in a tracking number the next day around this time. Right? Okay. I should get my stuff two days after that, no later than three days. Well, I ain't received my stuff yet, y'all. And I paid the extra. I could just did three to seven days. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know the website. If y'all shop on there. Just know I'm done with them. Mm -hmm. She said this the last time. I did. I said this the <laughs> last time. But still. Okay, I'm not going to order nothing from them if I need it quick. They're terrible. Girl. The stress. Okay, but like I mentioned earlier, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. Um, this video is probably gonna be like 11 minutes because I was talking for a long time before. So, if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe, girl. Hey, make sure you like and comment and share with your friends. And I'll see you guys on Monday. Bye. Say bye. Bye, y'all.